Hi, and welcome to another tutorial from Icon Pro Audio. The Platform Nano is a MIDI controller that offers tactile control of most digital audio workstations, several digital mixers, and some digital recorders using a single motorized fader. The Platform Nano comes straight from the factory with overlays for several of the most popular DAWs, plus an overlay for MIDI learn mode so you can do your own custom MIDI mapping. But today we're going to show you how to set up the Platform Nano with four of the most popular DAWs. Now we may not cover your DAW today, but most programs are set up in a similar fashion and between this video and the quick start guide that was included with your unit, you should have no problem getting up and running quickly no matter which DAW you prefer. So the first DAW we're gonna set up is Pro Tools and the first thing you'll do is power on your Platform Nano and use the double left and double right arrows to toggle to Huey mode. Hit DAW mode which will finalize your selection and now we will open up Pro Tools. Click the Setup tab and go to Peripherals. In the MIDI Controllers tab, the type should be Huey. We want to receive and send information to the Platform Nano. And now we hit OK. And we are connected. So next we're going to set up Cubase with the Platform Nano. And the first thing we want to do is power on our Platform Nano and use the double left and double right arrows to toggle through the DAW modes. We're looking for MCP mode. Select DAW mode to finalize the selection and now go into Cubase. We'll go to the Studio tab, select Studio Setup, Click the plus button to add a device. We're looking for Mackie Control. We want to select the Platform Nano for the MIDI input and MIDI output. And then we click Apply. And we are now connected to Cubase. Now we'll set up Reaper with the Platform Nano. And again, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to power on our Platform Nano using the double left and double right arrows to toggle through the DAW modes. We're looking for MCP mode for Reaper as well. Select DAW mode to finalize the selection. And we'll go into Reaper and select the Reaper tab. Select Preferences. We're going to add a device. And in the Control Surface mode, we're looking for Mackie Control Universal. We'll set up the MIDI input and MIDI output for Platform Nano and click OK. And now we are connected to Reaper. And for our final setup, we'll be using Logic Pro X with the Platform Nano. Power on your Platform Nano and use the double left to double right arrows to toggle through the DAW modes. We're looking for Logic Pro mode. Select the DAW mode to finalize your selection. Next, we're going to go to Logic Pro and turn it on on the computer. And now that Logic Pro is up, we're going to go to the Logic Pro X tab and select Control Surface. And then select Setup. In the Control Surface Setup, select New and install. We're looking for Mackie Control, Mackie Design, Logic Control. So we're going to scroll down here. Click Add. And we can close the screen now. And we want to choose the Platform Nano for the MIDI output and for the MIDI input ports. And now we can exit out of this screen. And we can hit play on our transport and now we see that we are connected because our playback head is moving. So thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel, like us, follow us. If you need more information, please visit us at iconproaudio.com.